Hundreds of volunteers are coming to Beckley tomorrow to provide different services for people who couldn't otherwise afford them. It's called the Beckley Day of Hope. And this morning, we welcome one of the events coordinators, C.L. Wilkerson. So, Mr. Wilkerson, or you want to be called C.L., right? C.L. Thank you for coming to the show. I really appreciate it. So, let's talk a little bit about some of the services that will be offered at the Day of Hope. Uh, Megan, we have, uh, we have free groceries. We have a hot lunch. We have uh, 1,500 pairs of tennis shoes. We have haircuts. We have... Um, family portraits, we have uh, health services, we have 35 different community services that will be with us on this day, veterans benefits, uh, a kid zone that's, uh, you know, that's like an acre and a half yeah. with the inflatables where kids can come and enjoy themselves in a safe environment. Keep them busy. Keep them busy. <laughs> and this is absolutely all free. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so we want people to come to enjoy themselves and those who may need a little helping hand up, yeah. um, it's Go ahead. Yeah, no, you're fine. So it also, you know, kids are going back to school. Some of them have already gone back. Some of them are going back this week and next week and all of that. So it really does help them get ready for school. You have shoes, family portraits, you know, groceries, all of that. We do. Or cuts. We do. We have doctors, dentists, optometrists who show up and um, who provide health services. Uh, it's, it's an exciting carnival-like uh, atmosphere. Uh, one of the things I do want to stress is, is that it's, it's named Beckley Day of Hope because it's in Beckley. Right. But really, it's Southern West Virginia Day of Hope. So, I mean, if you're from Wyoming County, if you're from Mullins or Pineville mm -hmm. or Bud or uh, if you're from Princeton, I mean, if you're from Summers County in Hinton or Fayette County, you yeah. know, please come. We, we, we'd love to see you on this day. And like you said, it really is a carnival-like atmosphere. You're seeing some of the pictures from the event in the past, but it really is a carnival-like atmosphere. It's helping people, but it really does feel like a festival. It does. I mean, it does. And we'll have, we'll have over 500 volunteers there who uh, really want to help you, to, to love on you, to show you respect and dignity. And uh, people who have been working for over three months yeah. Just to uh, just to make you uh, to to make this a great day for you. It's definitely a massive event, and just so people understand, they don't need to bring an ID or anything. They do not need to bring an ID. No type of identification. No questions are asked. Just bring yourself. Bring uh, bring your charming personality yeah. and come join us. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us. And just to go over it again, again, the Day of Hope is happening tomorrow at the Beckley Raleigh County Convention Center from 10 until 3 in the afternoon. You don't have to be a resident of Beckley. You just heard CL talking about that. Just come and take advantage of all the services. And you also don't need to bring an ID. If you live in Beckley and you need transportation, a bus schedule is posted at the BeckleyDayofHope.org. And I'll make sure that schedule is also posted on social media so we can make sure to get the word out that, you know, if you don't have transportation, you guys provide that as well. Thank you. Thank you so much for joining us. We hope you have a great day. My pleasure. All right. Let's send it over to Alita now.